everyone welcome back to my channel i'm mary and i talk about faith marriage and lifestyle thank you so much for your love and thank you for support always if you are new here you're welcome and feel at home today i'll be talking on the simple tips to cultivate a habit of daily walk with god you know a daily walk with god has the power to change your life you know in ways you never thought that is why you must be intentional by making time with god and a negotiable part of your day not because you feel obligated but because you know you desperately need god and his word as you know example of few ways a daily walk with god can change your lives are you know if you are lonely you know jesus can you know jesus wants to be your friend and a constant companion and if you feel fearful you know ghosts want to fill you with his strength and courage and if you're there and you feel confused you know god's word is the light for your path and if you're there you are tired you know god's word can fill you with strength on on any weary day and if you are happy or, or if you are unhappy discouraged or depressed you know a vibrant growing relationship with god will fill you with unspeakable joy and that is why you need to cultivate this habit of a daily walk with god so if you have not watched my video on habits every christian must cultivate can you click on the link in the description and in this video i share some of the few tips on how you can they are just simple tips on how you can cultivate a habit of daily work with God. The first tip is just make it non-negotiable. As I said earlier, you know, they know the same way you cannot sleep, you know, you cannot go to bed before brushing, you know, your teeth, you know. You can also not end your day without spending time with God, even if it is just five minutes, you know. As you know, for start, you cannot go one hour, you know, like someone else, you know, just start with this five minutes, you know, make it or instead make it a habit to begin your day with God daily. And this one will help you in your work with God. Another tip for you to cultivate a habit of a daily walk with God is, you know, choose a Bible reading plan that will work for you, you know. There are so many reading plans, you know, uh, Bible reading plans out there, but do some, you can do some research and, you know, and get one or start one that you are able to do or to keep. You know, don't feel like you need to read the whole Bible. No, you can just start by reading one, you know, one book of the Bible every month of every week, you know, for a start. And this one will help, you know, because, you know, you need to do something that will do it. You'll be able to do it continuously or every day. So you can start with just even one book per month or per week as the time goes you will improve and i pray that god will give you the grace another tip for you to grow in your walk with god just pick up the word and read you know pick up the word of god and read you know in this era of you know digital area you know bibles are always you know bibles are everywhere on your tablet on your phone laptop everywhere but you know that one cannot be compared by taking you know a bible you know a physical bible and read it you know it is very important for you to pick the word of god and read it because you know this one is going to help you to grow in your walk with god and you know when you read the word of god just physical word of god no on your tablet because sometimes you're on tablet or on phone you know messages are coming you know emails are coming you know whatsapp messages are coming there are so many distractions but if you you know you set aside everything and pick up the word of god and read it just from the physical bible this one is going to help you to grow in your work with god and i pray that god will give you grace another simple tip to walk in your uh, to cultivate this habit of daily work with god is prayer prayer is simply just communicating to god and listening what he's saying to us you know and you can only grow in your relationship with god through prayer that is why you must take this key of prayer seriously and you know for for 
the easiest way for you to remain focused on your prayer altar is just write your prayers in a notebook or in your in your prayer journal and uh, the, because this one will help you to stay focused during your prayer time and also will help you to talk to god for longer period of time so if you want to uh, know to to improve on your prayer altar i mean altar just document your prayers before praying you know document your prayers and the scriptures you know you you need the word of god that will back up your prayers that is why document your prayers and this and the bible scriptures that back up that prayer and this one will help you to remain focused and also to pray for a long time that will help i mean and as as you do this you know you are going to grow in your walk with God, you know, because you know, Bible reading and prayer, you know, are the two exchange, I mean, essentials, you know, for your growth, you know, for your spiritual growth. That is why you must cultivate these habits and I encourage you to cultivate this most important area and see what God will do for you because a daily walk with God has benefits, and that is why you know, I encourage you to just. Use these simple tips. They are just simple tips that I've shared. And you know, you can do them anywhere. You know, just, you know, do these things that I've shared in this video. And I pray that you find it helpful. And I pray that you will walk with God. And you know, you will walk with God daily. Thank you so much for watching. And thank you so much for your time. If you have not watched my video on how to grow your work in your work with God, just click on the link in the description to watch that video and I pray that you find it helpful. And if you've gotten something in this video, kindly give this video a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, please just click on that red button below the video to subscribe. And also you can share this video with those you think they need it. Thank you so much for your love and see you in my next video. Bye.